Zoe, it is so good to be in the kitchen with you here today, but we are separated, not just because of social distancing <laughs> regulations, but we are about to embark on the ultimate challenge. Mm. Who can make the best post-workout smoothie? Well, look, you know how much I love you, but in this case, I'm quite happy for you to keep your distance because I don't want you trying to sabotage my beautiful beverage. I am a massive fan of foods that are all nutrient dense and good for us. And I'm using baby spinach in my smoothie. It's one of my favorite ingredients. It's so versatile, sweet or savory, but it's packed full of magnesium, which as you and I know, is great for your muscles. We are so on the same page, ZBP. I'm also focusing on magnesium in the form of raspberries. Magnesium is one of the most abundant minerals in the human body, and it's involved in over 600 enzymatic reactions. Magnesium can help us in our day-to-day -day lives because hopefully we're all exercising. So it's certainly going to help our recovery from exercise, which will then encourage our ongoing commitment to our exercise goals. I want to hear a little bit about, you know, what is it you're doing at home exercise-wise? All right, so I'm definitely keeping it simple. I'm going back to basics. I am doing squats, lunges okay. and push-ups. Now, right. I'll tell you what, they use all of the muscles in my body, they burn lots of energy and they make me crave this smoothie. It is so, so good. Now, I love... Pilates. I'm someone who's always done reformer Pilates, but obviously I can't go there right now. So I'm at home doing mat Pilates. All I can say, it is so much harder. <laughs> so. We're both really, really active, and it's so important at this point in time to keep moving, especially with so much time spent at home. Now, speaking of moving, it is time to get blitzing. Magnesium helps people who are exercising a lot by two main ways. Firstly, it counteracts calcium, which would otherwise cause the muscle to contract, maybe spasm, and be quite sore after exercise. The second way is that magnesium helps to clear lactate from the muscles. Lactate is what contributes to fatigue and delayed onset muscle soreness, or DOMS, which is that feeling of soreness that we often get after exercise and more particularly um, high intensity or high impact sessions. This looks absolutely perfect, Zoe. Now, as much as I love that we've celebrated baby spinach and raspberries today, the good thing about finding magnesium is that our post-workout smoothie can be really versatile. Things like avocado, frozen banana, and my favourite, raw cacao powder. We can get magnesium from the diet, but most people find that it's either tricky to obtain enough of the magnesium-rich foods or they're needing more than they could possibly eat. So that's when they can definitely look to supplementing their diet with a magnesium supplement. Oh my God, come on, that <laughs> can't be good for you. That is unbelievable. It is, now I wanna try yours. All right, take my green goddess. Yeah, it looks very <laughs> healthy. I've gotta give it to you. My muscles are already feeling thankful for this. <laughs>